If I am in a simulation, how can humans, I've done video, many videos on this on the YouTube channel, ever be happy if they haven't got connection with people? Well, I think good is to look at sort of rational points in, a, in our life. Uh, look at, say, for a hermit, for example. A hermit will live separate from society. Now, he may have his own emotional mental health problems that brought him to that point, possibly, uh, but he is usually he's not chronically anxious. He might be, but usually not. Uh, and so if he's not chronically anxious, it shows that he can be content living in a hut. Uh, perhaps if that, I'm picturing this sort of stereotype of a hermit, they're not all like that, obviously, for, for just the sort of stereotype, but for explaining it. If he's living in a hut in the woods with a few animals around him, he's fine. And we know that we can be fine because we've spent time doing different things where we spend time on our own. Maybe we go to uh, for a walk on our own. Maybe we go and spend a day somewhere on our own in the countryside, whatever. Uh, and we realise that we don't die from it. We, would need, we like to have it. It's really beneficial for us but we don't die without it. We can stand it. And even if we did die without it, we could still make peace with accepting, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pass away, the same as people who are terminally ill. So we're giving up that internal control, that internal needing. It's us telling ourselves, I need this, I must have this, and without that, I can't relax or be content at all. Uh, that's, that's the problem there. 